by EVGA. The latest version of EVGA Precision X now supports overclocking via Bluetooth on an Android device. So let's show you exactly how that's done. The first thing I'm going to do is go into the options. Next I'm going to enable the option that allows external access via Bluetooth. Next you want to get your Android device. Make sure that your Android device is paired with your PC via Bluetooth. I'm going to go ahead and load the application that I downloaded from the Google Play Marketplace and I'm going to pair it to my PC. And here it is, EVJ Precision X for Android. You can see that it has most of the functionality that EVJ Precision X has. I can adjust fan speeds, I can even increase my power target. And I can increase both my GPU clock offset and memory offsets. I can even save it to a profile. If I hit the arrow in the upper left hand corner I can see my GPU vitals in real time. One of the cool things that this lets me do is adjust my GPU settings in a full screen application in real time. So for example here I'm using my Android device to increase the GPU frequency. Now I'm going to increase my memory frequency. And now I'm adjusting my fan speed. EVGA Precision X Android application allows me to adjust my GPU settings in real time in full screen applications like a benchmark or a game. So to learn more about EVGA Precision X for Android, please visit the EVGA website at www.evga.com forward slash precision.